Died what? <laughs> Wanna come, everybody? <laughs> Wanna come, everybody? My name is Uncle Peru, and this is Uncle Bala. Uncle Bala got PhD. Why are they laughing for what you? What are bloody man? Indians laughing for? Uncle Bala got PhD. Y'all don't believe me, what? I got PhD? Past high school with difficulty. <laughs> Why are you laughing? You also got PhD. I also got PhD, ma. Tell them what PhD you got. But ma, the horrible dragon. <laughs> but you got two degrees, Peru. I also got MBA. What MBA? Married but available. <laughs> <laughs> Sit down there, pour one shot quickly, Peru. Hey, the lady taking picture with. How long you posing there, ma? I'm not posing, I'm stuck. <laughs> so nice to see so many Indian people here, Peru. How come so many Indian people stay by Joe Beg, ma? No, you see, it all started in 1860 when the ships came from India, you know? Yeah. All the Indians who had the university education, yeah. they ride with Cape Town. Yeah. All the Indians who had metric, yeah. they ride with Amshlanga. All the Indians were standard five, they were in Chatsworth. All the Indians were class two, they ride Phoenix. And all the Indians who never go to school, they ride with Lanasia. <laughs> Not nice to laugh about other people's problems, eh? Ay, 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 ay. Too strong, Peru. Ah, too much a dash, yeah. One European man met me outside, he said, Uncle, you look like a senior citizen, cultured man. Why Indian women wear the red dot on the head? Nice to ask, you know. I said, nice to ask about the Indian people. Indian women wear the red dot on the head because that means in the bed they're on standby. <laughs> Why are you talking nonsense, Peru? Wrong answer, that. That's a wrong answer, Peru. Why do they wear the red dot then? Where's Michael? <laughs> Where's Michael? Michael, put your hand up. Oh, there. Hey, Michael, when your hand go up, it's so white, it look like lightning. <laughs> <laughs> Michael, let me tell you something. Don't listen to this old man. He's talking nonsense, right? The reason Indian women wear red dot yeah. is because they're recording. <laughs> Ten years later, you'll have one argument, they'll place a replay, the whole thing will come out. <laughs> hey, Peru, the bloody Indian women are clapping. <laughs> like we're bloody joking, what? Hey, but I met one, two aunties, yeah, Peru. Hey, hot, hot aunties oh, in Joburg, yeah. my sugar and pressure and everything shot up. Eh? I met one auntie in the front, in the foyer. Yeah. I couldn't control myself. Yeah. I said, pss, pss. You said, pss, pss, where? Not pss, pss, Peru. What pss, you said, for her? Pss, pss. And what she said? What's wrong, uncle? You got punch in your face. <laughs> I reckon, madam, I just have to tell you. You are like one in a million. Oh yeah, what a compliment you paid her. I couldn't control myself. One Peru. in a million, eh? You like one in a million. And what she said? So are your chances. <laughs> <laughs> now I reckon, eh, who's the celebrity here, Peru? Yeah, you the celebrity. I reckon, eh, madam, you're giving me carne. Eh. You know who I am. Eh. I reckon, eh, madam, let me tell you something. 
You look like Mona Lisa. Oh, what a compliment you pay there. She reckon you said blushing, Peru. And you went red. Red. Ah. She reckon why? Because I'm beautiful. Ah. I reckon no, because you look like you bloody belong in a museum. <laughs> bloody giving me attitude. I was walking behind one auntie in the foyer, the right. Oh, you from the back like a Baywatch figure she had there. Katak, 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 katak is going. Must be from lodium. My Peru. sugar and pressure and all shot up. My breathing became heavy. Like a Baywatch figure she had. Oh, yeah, she turned around like a crime watch face she had. She must be from Daxina. <laughs> Sati Ma, if they measured ugly by bricks, she'll be the Great Wall of China. One, two, Kaza, so yeah, Peru. Hey, Lani people in Joburg, eh? Oh, you, you must check the Kappa. Eh. Lamborghini. Eh. Mercedes Benz. Eh. BMW. Ferrero Rush. Ferrero Rush. And in the middle of all of that, eh. one Skoda Skoda Toyota test. <laughs> Just check eh. that Toyota test that you must have bought it through Desi Life uh, Rewards Program. Why? That thing can't be worth more than 20,000 rand. Per yeah, but what he bought through Desi Life then? They give discounts eh. on everything. Right. Yeah, that thing must be 50 grand, he paid 20 for it. But 20,000 rand, eh. you can just make out that thing belong to a charo. How you know, ma? 40,000 rand mag wheels. <laughs> Now I'm telling you, a car that is worth 20,000 rand, uh. that got 40,000 ma rand mag wheels, yeah. that's a bad investment. Why, ma? That's the same thing like me sending sours for a boob job. <laughs> bad investment, man. Sending your 72-year-old missus for a boob job is like putting two snooker balls in one's stockings. <laughs> How you know what my dragon snooker balls look like? We want to apologize, but we came a little bit late. No, you know what happened? Amma's sick in the hospital, man. Amma's critical, eh? While we was in the ward now, Amma had one heart attack. Hmm. Right, the doctor shouted, bring the paddles, bring the paddles. But now went and slapped the doctor. Why? She said, Amma, Amma having a heart attack and you're going to go canoeing now. <laughs> then just before we came, one man knocking on my door, I opened the thing, I said, I'm going, I'm going to a show now. He said, Uncle, you want to be a Jehovah's Witness? Jehovah's Witness? I said, Omudu, you want me to be Jehovah's Witness? I never even see the accident. <laughs>